I also got an extra small to try on, but that's definitely just gonna be like too small. Wow, oh, what is? <laughs> Join me as I brave central London, mostly Selfridges, in search of the perfect ski outfit for my upcoming trip to the French Alps. So Bay turns the big 4-0 soon, and to celebrate, I've arranged a weekend in a luxurious chalet in Chamonix, France, complete with all the amenities you could think of. Outdoor jacuzzi overlooking the world-famous Mont Blanc mountain, private first-rate chef, and nine ensuite bedrooms to hold all of our friends. You know how I do. Everything related to a ski trip can be very expensive, so my intention with respect to my ski clothing was to get stuff secondhand. I knew I wasn't gonna rent, because your girl gotta look cute. And of course, I'm excited by the designer stuff, but ain't nobody got a casual couple grand <laughs> to just drop on a ski suit, so. I started looking on Depop and I started seeing some things that I really liked and I actually found some things that I liked that were fairly affordable in as much as you can call ski gear affordable. But I wasn't about to buy an outfit on Depop or Vinted that I couldn't return without knowing how it properly fit. So this one particular brand that I really liked called My Sunday Ski, I knew Selfridge is carried, so I beelined my way there to see if this brand is what would keep me cute on the slopes in Chamonix, France. Okay, got a couple of things to try on. A few Sunday, my Sunday ski items. This is super cute from PE Nation, so we gonna see what this is gonna be like. Honestly, already sweating from like how much work this is gonna be to try on, but we committed, so we doing it. I wore a few layers for the sake of trying things on, so now I'm gonna take it all off and just see how it works. So God, obviously I won't try these on in, on, in the, under any of the pants. I got one pair of leggings and another pair of leggings and a long sleeve, so we'll see how these things fit underneath so we can find the size. This is super cute. Yeah, just ask they got the next one. Actually, really like this one. It's super cute. I love the colors. This was not a brand I was planning to look for or try on here. Damn, my waist be looking snatched. Mmm, this is cool. This is a size small. Um, I mean, I definitely specifically came here to try on the My Sunday Ski, which we're about to in a moment, but this is so cute. I really love the colors. Call me your everyday with a ski bunny. Chocolate ski bunny. So this is the jacket that goes with these PE, um, what is it called? PE Nation Salad Pets. And like, while it's fun, I feel like before it was giving like cute little ski bunny, and now I'm just giving like snowboarder girl. I'm actually not a snowboarder girl. I think I like the Salad Pets, but I think I would probably just want to like, I like it for apres ski. I know I should be getting things practical for actually skiing, but I like it for apres ski. The whole get down is like a little bit too much for me. So yeah, we'll see. My Sunday ski coat in white and a size small. So it's a cropped jacket, but the thing that's nice is that it comes with like this zipping on the inside that when you buy the bottoms, the bottoms are in different color because they don't have white in my size, you can zip the jacket into the pants so just to make sure that you stay super insulated and like protected from the elements when you were skiing oh, little inside pockets and everything okay we need to learn more about all the uses for these things okay so we have a size small of the pants my sunday ski and a size small of the cropped jacket it's like super cute let me zoom out so you can see more and i'll turn to the side because i I only have one moon boot, so not to ruin the effect. We can see what it looks like with a moon boot. This is the champagne color. This is the pearl white color. Um, the set is actually, meant, I think, meant to be white and white and champagne and champagne. But we are trying on based on what they have in stock. It is super cute, but I'm going to keep it real. 
after I tried on this PE Nation style of pet, which was like quite heavy duty and felt super water resistant and like thick, um, I don't know how warm this would keep me on the slopes. It's super cute though. I need to like, I would need to try it and test it and see. I am kind of sweating in here now. I think this would definitely just require like a lot more base layers for someone who is cold like a lot of the time. But it is, it is very cute. It's just interesting trying something that felt more heavy duty and this does feel a bit more like aesthetic. It is also like half the price of this set. So I think that kind of makes sense. But as I said, we're trying to look cute affordably. We're not trying to break the bank. So decisions, decisions. I also got an extra small to try on, but that's definitely just going to be like too small. But how it is. <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll see. Okay, a lot of just trying on for size, but as we envision, this extra small is definitely extra small, and this is not getting enough. It's not getting up around around this. <laughs> um, I'm always kind of forgetting what size I am, but this must be. I think down below I'm like a UK six to eight. Up top I'm like a UK four to six, and these are probably for like a UK four to six so not happening for us but it's okay we can we filling out in all the right places okay so this is the perfect ski pant by my sunday ski and this is a small and even though the small fit me in the spandex um i forget what they're called this version the small in the my perfect ski pant which has less stretch it's like i don't even know it's not even really getting around these hips but keep in mind i'm also wearing like two layers of like base stuff but still just just good to know they're cute though okay i know this looks a little bit crazy but i'm just giving this a try on with a thicker like chunkier sweater underneath obviously i wouldn't wear like a hoodie underneath this cropped ski jacket but i just want to see when i add thickness underneath this small what the fit is like and definitely obviously feels warmer but i feel like it also feels like kind of looks like it's like pulling not not in a technical way like it's practically gonna pull apart but the fit just kind of looks like it's pulling a little bit more when i put something chunkier underneath so i feel like a part of what keeps this looking cute not so much but a part of what keeps this looking cute is like a, a normal kind of like base layer maybe like two base layers but you can't excuse me necessarily wear anything super chunky underneath this after the fitting room i slipped my feet into a pair of moon boots to see if they were worth the hype and the day was a wrap I think it's obvious which outfit was my favorite from what I tried on, but you'll just have to stay tuned to the next vlog to see what I actually got. Even though I did this shopping trip back in December, hence all the festive season decor that you are seeing in this vlog, I am actually editing this on the morning of my flight to the French Alps. So wish me luck on the slopes and I will see you at Prey Ski next video. Don't you know that you're so fine, you're so fine, you're so fine, you're so fine, baby, 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 baby.